Sarah and welcome back to my channel. Now this is probably not the intro that you were expecting for a vlog, but I'm here in the present time telling you that this vlog is from way back in September. It was actually my very first day of my fourth year of university. I don't know why I never got up to editing it and actually posting it, but now looking back as I'm on the brink of graduating, I want to have memories of this year, even with COVID and everything that went on and basically shifted my entire year to online. But this first vlog, I actually was able to still go onto campus and everything and have somewhat of a normal-ish experience all my classes were online, but I was able to go on for like club stuff and everything So yeah, I thought I would show it to you guys a for me to look back on but also for some entertainment for you guys But yeah, just note that this was back in September when restrictions were looser than what they are now And also you'd be able to tell that this was back in September because my hair was a lot more blonder than it is now It is definitely grown out because all of these salons have been closed at least here in Toronto but Yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this little looking into the past vlog and enough of the rambling Let's get into watching the vlog Sarah and for today's video I'm going to be vlogging my very last first day of university so I'm going into fourth year university here at Western University and everything is online so that's gonna be fun but I actually was able to get ready today because I actually do some volunteering on campus and today was my first shift so I decided to kind of get ready as if it was my real first day of school on campus but it is my real first day online but yeah I'm going to be heading onto campus for my first shift I just volunteer with the university and yes I have this purple lighting on today because it's like really gloomy outside today and I needed the extra lighting. I'm to show you my outfit really quickly. I'm actually just about to head out the door. So it's super purple in the background as you can tell but I'm wearing a white top from Abercrombie, my mom jeans from Abercrombie and some slippers but I'm not going to actually be wearing those out. I'm going to be changing those and then this is just a belt from Amazon and I just kind of curled my hair to kind of make it more feel like it's my first day of school and have a cute little outfit even though as soon as I get home I'm definitely going to change back into leggings but for now I'm going to look cute. But yeah I'm going to head on to campus and I'll see you guys in a little bit. I just finished my volunteering and now I'm heading back home where I'm going to do all of my online lectures. I'm just on UC Hill here if you know Western campus and everything and my hair has completely pooped. I tried to take a couple of pictures like, to commemorate my last first day of school and all my curls have fallen out of my hair because of how humid it is. But yeah, I'm going to go home and probably have like a little snack. It's around like 11.30 and then go and do some work. So I'm home now and I just change out of my jeans into some like comfy leggings just so I can be like comfy the rest of my day. But yeah, I'm going to go and probably make something to eat just because it's let me ask Alexa 11 45 you heard it from Alexa so I'm going to make myself something to eat and then I'm going to get to work for the rest of my day so I was about to make a sandwich and have something to eat but I realized my bread isn't defrosted so I'm going to do my to-do list for today so I'm going to write my to-do list today and kind of everything that I want to accomplish and then check it off as I accomplish it I feel like that's gonna help me like kind of organize more of like what I want to do in a day and which courses I want to focus on and write them down in my little to-do list
finished my first lecture for this class. It's like an aging class, learning about aging. And I can finally click it off my little to-do list thing here. Now I'm going to check off my little bubble of something that I accomplished. So now that I finished that lecture, I'm going to go and make myself a sandwich and hopefully my bread is defrosted. So I am eating my sandwich. I have it here and I'm doing my reading. I just have a reading for this one class and then a couple more things for that class and then I'm done with that class for today. So it's around three o'clock now and I finished the reading, but I'm starting to feel like that like midday slump. So I think I'm going to make myself an iced coffee and have that to like kind of re-energize me for the rest of the day and then get to working on all the other things that I assigned myself for today. I think I overestimated how long it's gonna take me to do things because I haven't done work in a while. I think I have to change some of these things to do tomorrow, but we'll see how much I get done for today. I'm gonna to go and make an iced coffee now. to outside of my room and into our little dining room kitchen area to do the rest of my work because you gotta change up the space as you know because literally we're only inside but i'm going to drink my iced coffee and i have a little chocolate dip donut which is so nice so i'll reward myself once i'm done another little tick off my checklist but yeah I'm going to open up my laptop and do some more work here <laughs> I've done my lecture, I've done the reading, I've done the two activities that I need to do, and then the ongoing engagement, which is basically like I have to write two multiple choice questions. And now I'm going to do actually this little mission. It's like you have to like introduce yourself to the class. I am vlogging, so I'll be able to mark that off. And then I don't know if I'll be able to finish these. I think I'm gonna start the Fizz Lecture 1. Fizz Lecture 2, writing this on the air was like, a very big like leap. I didn't think I was even gonna be able to complete it, but it's probably gonna end up having to go to it tomorrow, but that's okay. <laughs> work for like this afternoon I'm still gonna work more in the evening yeah I'm going to head to campus to go and finish my other volunteering and then I will see you guys in a bit so I am back on campus for the day and I'm heading to the UCC to volunteer <laughs> volunteering and it's around 7 30 7 40 right now and i ordered myself some swish la because i don't know i was hungry and i didn't feel like cooking tonight plus it was the first day of school kind of like a first day of school celebratory dinner if that makes sense but yeah i'm going to enjoy that i think it's supposed to be here in like 20 ish minutes i ordered it just as i was finishing my volunteer shift so let's check the app and see what it says 7 48 oh wow they're on their way already originally it said like 803 or something so now it says 7 48 and 7 37 so i'll have my dinner in around 10 minutes i'm gonna work a little bit more on my physiology lecture i was able to start that so at least i'll be able to like click off a lot of my little boxes on my checklist and then yeah that was pretty much a day with me so i'll see you guys in a little bit when i'm eating my food so my swish la food just got here and i was working a little bit more on my physiology but i think i'm gonna call it a night i've realized with online school like there isn't really a time to stop like you can kind of just keep working which is a good thing and also a bad thing because I feel like you can overwork but I'm going to kind of go through my list today and see what I accomplished so I finished all of those assignments I'm working on the lecture one I'm about halfway through it maybe even three quarters of the way through it so I'm not going to check that off and I didn't get to lecture two I probably didn't even think that was going to happen anyways but I still wrote it down but I did vlog, so I am going to cross that off. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this little day in my life of my first day of online university in my last year of university. But yeah, that's so weird to say, but that's the reality of it. But yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. See you guys next time. Bye.